Hi everyone! So I'm gonna answer a question that I received and someone had asked how can I find the time to write more than 100 books? Um, well my journey on writing kind of started uh, 30 years ago <laughs> um, and I started winning awards when I was still in high school and though I liked it um, it kind of became a full-time thing when I had my cliff diving accident at 19 years old. Um, I was told I'd never walk again and I'd never have children and luckily I'm walking. Yay! But um, spending 13 months in a wheelchair definitely gave me time to sit and write and um, once I kind of could hobble again I went up to the local newspaper and said hey can you give me a job? And um, the first one said no. So I went to the one across the street and they were like, hey, um, can you make our competition look bad? And I was like, yeah. And they were like, you're hired. So <laughs> one of my weird specialties that I've acquired over the years. Um, but people like it. <laughs> so they started me as an intern um, and that quickly developed into more because one of my best friend's moms told me about a corrupt person, went up Spurn statewide investigation had my own writing team from the New York Times, my whole team of lawyers, um, because the owner of the newspaper was Heinz Proctor. Um, he famously committed suicide, um, and so my time <laughs> ended there when he ended. Um, but I went on to different newspapers, magazines, um, until I was pulled on stage by Rob Zombie and offered a job on OzFest. Um, after that, I moved to Key West, I moved to New Orleans, got involved with some music industry, movie industry stuff, um, wound up going to Johns Hopkins for my undergrad, and just wound up writing more. I became more involved with sports afterwards. So this led to first covering nautical sports, working at the newspaper down in Key West, then I got involved with baseball, and <laughs> all kinds of other things. So it's been a weird journey. But my biggest tip for writing is to find time each day, usually an hour when you first wake up or an hour right before you go to bed or you have more creative times. So if you aim for both of those, maybe you might get one of the two. And that's how I do it. So anyways, maybe that will help you create some stuff. So hopefully it will. And I'll see you in class.